Hello and welcome. My name is Mihai and today I'll show you how to use an electric pump for the first time. In this setup we have a 12 volt pump fitted with a battery inside a 10 TCG. You might have a 240 volt or a 110 volt, it doesn't really matter. All electric pumps work the same. The pumps that we provide are self-priming, which means you don't have to worry too much about using it for the first time. However, there are a few tips that you can use to make life easier. First of all, make sure you have the tank full. It helps to have at least 80% full, but we normally recommend that you just fill it up to the normal 95%. That will mean you'll have a fuel level that sits just above the pump, and that will help the pump prime itself much faster. Once that is sorted, Ensure that you turn the fuel on by turning the ball valve in the forward position. For a 12 volt pump, proceed to connect the crock cables to the battery. For a 240 volt or 110 volt pump, just plug it into a main power source. It's very important on 12 volt and 24 volt pumps that you get a polarity right. That means just follow the colors on the crock clips to match the colors on the battery. So we'll, we're starting with a negative, which is always black. We'll connect the black first, and then we'll go on and connect the red one. That being said, to make sure you get fuel in the pump, just open the 2 inch port on the tank, get the nozzle straight into the tank and put it into the open position. This will allow any air in the pump to go through the nozzle into the tank and as soon as fuel starts going through it, it will go back into the tank making sure you, you're not making a mess. So you don't necessarily need to have a vehicle nearby, you can use the tank to do the whole thing. Next step is very simple, we just switch the pump on. Each pump will have a button, sometimes you'll have to look for it because it can be at the bottom of the pump. Keep it running for 30 seconds. If it hasn't primed yet, turn off the pump, allow it to cool for 2 minutes and try again. Sometimes the process takes a little bit for the air to fill up through the non-return valve and go through. You will hear the nozzle cough, if I can say it. That's absolutely normal. Just let it go until it runs smoothly, then you can go ahead and turn off the pump and switch off the nozzle. That is difficult to get it primed, and despite all attempts, it still doesn't work. Sometimes you can get an airlock inside the nozzle. So just disconnect the nozzle and put the hose straight in. It's just an O-ring here, so you can't damage anything. Untwist counterclockwise, remove from the nozzle, put the hose straight into the tank and try again. That reduces the resistance of the nozzle and should make life a lot easier. Once fuel goes through, reconnect the hose to the nozzle and you're good to go. And that's how you set up an electric pump for use for the first time. I hope you found it useful. Thank you for watching. See you next time.